Bangladeshis and the Bengalis in Ozone Park because we had some issues there with racial profiling and hate crimes. Today we're celebrating the wonderful 20th anniversary. So let's give ourselves a warm round of applause for meeting 20 years with this association, for continuing to live the American dream, and for making sure that we lay the foundations for our children to have a better life. And brothers and sisters, we have to continue to fight. We have fought with you every step of the way. Whether it was Alal in schools, whether it was Bengali on the ballot, and as a district leader, we've always stood up with you and fought for the good things, for education, better health care, and for a better life in America. Indeed, I ran for office because I wanted to racially profile us, to make sure that racially profiling could become the law of New York State. But we defeated that bill by fighting against it. And we have got to join hands and continue to fight. I am Guyanese from Richmond Hill, but I'm Bengali in faith and in courage like you. And inshallah, we'll get there because ours is a common fight and a common battle, a common, a common will to make sure that we have a better life and a better America for us to live in and for generations to come. And for leaders like these, my good friend Delmar, we are so grateful that Allah has sent. Allah does not come, but He sends His messengers, and it's just as if He came. So inshallah, brother, continue to fight the good fight, continue to fight the worthy fight, where we can have a better quality in life, and we can truly live the American dream. Where is getting more cricket grounds, more schools, more um, masjids, more uh, religious schools and, and vacations, and, and textbooks, and computers. God willing, inshallah, we'll get there. Thank you very much, and God bless you all.